Hello, I'm Whitley Strieber. Welcome back to But Something Is There. Since the beginning of time, people have had dreams. We've always wondered what dreams truly mean. Dream time, or dreaming for Australian Aboriginal people, represents the time when the ancestral spirits moved over the land, creating life and important geographic and physical formations. The dreaming explores the origin of the universe and workings of nature and humanity. It's not so surprising that the Wangina spirits of the aboriginals are represented as cave paintings of beings with large heads and black eyes. These paintings date back 4,000 years. In this story, the visitor experience evolves. It will take us to the very heart of the communion between us and them. Mark will learn that nothing ever truly dies. He will also learn how we are connected to all spirit and every living thing. Join us in this remarkable experience of the dream time.
okay, Father? Is that you? Yes, it's me, Mark. God, how I love you. I've always wanted to tell you the secret of our family, but I passed away before I ever could. And by now you well know, we've always been connected. I feel and I see you every time you think of me. I'm in your heart. I, I, I feel you too. I've always, I've always been able to feel you too. I, comforting me, but I never knew if it was real or not. I question that, I question that experience. I knew you were involved. I knew they would come for you, but there was nothing I could do about it. In the late 1940s, I was working on a top secret project for our government. When the visitors came, they made a pact with them. They promised them certain rights in exchange for their knowledge and technology. rights to our families and to our children to study. Rights to you, Mark. I, I, I always, I always knew you loved me. I always knew that. I, I, I could see you. There was a sadness though in your eyes. I stuck by you, and I guided you every step of the way, knowing that you'd be different as a result. I knew about the men in dark suits, and how they came for you and the other children in the middle of the night. How they took you to schools and probed your mind for what you knew and what they thought you might be capable of. You knew that. I never told anybody that. That was, that was terrifying. I thought that was a dream. I thought it was a dream. Those visitors, I feared them. But those, what did you say? Those men in dark suits, middle of the night, took us away, did things. Yes, it is true, Mark. It happened. But it happened to many other children as well, not just you. Those men had dark intentions. But the visitors, they showed you the stars and beyond and all its possibilities. And, well, as a result, you've never been able to view the night sky the way the other children have. None of you have. But now you're starting to find out how important all this really is, Mark. For us, and for them. It has to happen. It means our very survival. This, this means so much. This means so much to me. Thank you, thank you. Well, you can also thank the visitors, Mark. They made it possible for us to discover the link between us and them. I have to go now, Mark. No. Uh, but you're gonna see me again soon. Just remember to always keep your heart and mind open to all the possibilities. I'll be there to guide you every step of the way. I love you, Mark. Wait, wait. Grandfather. Grandfather? I love you. I love you, Grandfather. You're awake now.
Amen. And they told him, Moses, please. What do you do? I, I'm not the man you see before you with your eyes. What? I'm not the monster. I'm not the monster. Okay, please. Okay. Help me with this. Please! Okay. <laughs> Hang on. Okay. Why? Why are you here? Why are you here? This is my nightmare. Why are you here? You're not who you appear to be. What? What does that mean? This is my nightmare. In my world, I am asleep, experiencing this now. talk to you. I cannot wait until I talk to you. Please. Please. Okay. Okay. Um, so you need my help. Your, your help? Yeah. What could I possibly do to help you? Um... You're a monster, and you need my help? Giant's a monster. But I am also not the monster. They did this to me. They want me to show you what could happen. They. And what could that possibly be? What could that be? Come in for me. My God, man. The example of this is monster. This one never to be followed again. It is one never to be followed again. So, so you have regret. And is that enough? God, God, no, it, it can never be enough. Not ever. Living a life in a world where, where these things, they never happen. World War II never happened. I, I have seen this world too. I've seen this world, I've been there. Not just you, Mark. Millions of people like you. Okay. I know what I'm experiencing right now is not a dream. At least I don't think it's a dream. What could we possibly do to change the world? And to, to ask someone like you. What? What? What can you do? What can you do? Yes. What can you do? That's what I said. What can you do? 
You can try to change your future's outcome? In, in my fault? That I am sleeping now? We put an end to war, hatred, and greed. We reached Simone, Mars, and beyond. Mark. In my world, we touched the stars. How did you experience this world? We all live parallel lives, Mark. Certainly you must know this by now. Um, I think I'm beginning to. It's not too late. One tiny change can affect the timeline. One change can affect the future outcome. How do we end the cycle? People, people are born innocent. We come into this world pure innocence. All we want unconsciously is peace and to live. But we are pulled in by this darkness. People need to realize it's a power mark. It's a power to say no. It's a power to embrace love. love and wonder. No civilization can survive without these things, at least not for very long. I've been to some place, mm, not like this, peaceful, serene. I call it the park. It felt like a middle ground between life and death. This is the place that we go to when your physical life comes to an end. It has many different names. So what now? You clearly aren't the same person you were when we started this conversation. I'm starting to wake up. You? Yeah. In my world, I'm aware that I'm dreaming and that I'm here with you. Time seems to work differently now. If it even exists at all. Maybe I'm Hitler, or worse, in this other universe. If that is the case, Mark, you will connect with it. And it will affect you. But Mark, you can make a difference. One day, you will do something so profound that the people of the world will stop for the very first time and look up. They will look up to the stars and say for wonder why they never looked up before. Mark, when you show them that death is not the end, then the fear they have will end and the darkness to destroy his worlds. It will come to an end.
Wait. There's something you're not telling me. Right? Jasa is... I have seen your Veld's future. Okay. Well, what is it? What is... What is that future? I can show it to you. But prepare yourself, Mark. And follow me. What happened? What happened was that the men and the women of your world did not have their priorities in order. The very scientists told them that when they died, they would cease to exist. They had no evidence of this. But they told the people anyway. And this led to so much fear that they gave in to the darkness. They failed to realize that if we continue our exploration into space, it would lead to hope, jobs, advances in science so profound that it would lead to the end of hunger, to all diseases, even death itself, as they would have hope. But instead, the rape of the earth continued. The wars continued. Never once did they solve the problems of Earth burst. They never made the life bolt that would have saved the entire human race. They feared death and so destroyed themselves. And this is the of reward. Still hope, Mark. That's all we saw. Never give up. This doesn't have to happen. Never let it happen again. Never. When the time comes, you will know what to do. I'll be the same in the night. Is it just my imagination? Saw you dancing into the sky. Is it for you or the world itself that I cry? Every brother is fighting each other. Will it stop with a cup of rain? Is it true the down inside we're the same? All I know is all I am. All I am is you. Is you. Understanding Only darkness can be trained And together we can push those clouds away Hey, hey So you think you want a new revolution Well, it has to be given the heart Anything else will just tell us all apart
still hope, Mark. Never give up. So that's always hope.